Any sword fighter versus Aegis. Is it just me or is, it, is that the only Aegis skin we've seen today? It's like the Ryuko Mata skin. <laughs> I mean that's cool. As that's long as really they're not skin. as long as they're not using the one that reverses the, the colors. Oh, I actually think that one should just be banned, bro. I, don't like, like I have to think too hard every time I see that card. I don't like it, it just bothers me. It looks weird. Like I'm playing against them and I'm like, oh yeah, this yeah, is. Yeah, I think this is skin good. Leo uses too. <laughs> Man. <laughs> He's playing the the mind games. The not scum. the mind games. Play land win game, bro. Yeah. Alright, so uh, we're gonna see who the better uh swords swords lady is. I used to say swordsman. Men is in the word woman. Yeah. Let's see who the better swordman is here. And uh, <laughs> Orpah's, uh taking the first stock here. Putting Aaron on high alert. Uh oh. Here we go. Get them up here. Oh no, I'm tripping. Orpah's died first. I am tripping, bro. <laughs> I was too busy thinking about sword women, bro. <laughs> here we go. Oh, taking a stock. <laughs> uh. Uh, sitting at 93%, you know, things aren't going the best right now, yep. especially after that up air. When I saw that down throw, down throw up air like is a bro. you have to you have to be behind that move before they grab you. You have to be prepared for a down throw up air. That move is See, so and I was good. I was talking to Doctor P about it because he likes to use the hero spin, mm -hmm. and I think like the hero spin is like the you know the cheese that's gonna kill you early move. But yeah. I was like, why don't you use the down throw up air? And he was like, it's viable. And I'm like, eh, like really like it's hard, I, I see people. Know, like just just die from it all the like like that. I need to look yeah. like, <laughs> like you have to be ready for that and if you're not ready or if you don't know how to fight me tour fighter good luck it's a done data yeah very that was a very quick first game by Aaron just kind of just running through the competition running through the player there just down throw up air Man. getting those kill confirms but uh the up special that Aaron uses is the one that's going to give you the better recovery so I'm like, I don't know if you want to go with better recovery. But then uh, Dr. Pete did present uh, a very good fact. It was like, look at these top tier characters and what's their biggest fault, their recovery. And I'm like, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll give that to you. Because in this game, you are not a top tier character unless you have a way to kill your opponent at 70 or 80%. Yep. Like if you, if you just don't have a way to, to rob a stock, you're not going to be able to keep up with the race of Smash Bros. Yeah, I mean, you also, like, this isn't as important, but, like, having those combos to get 50, 60% in, like, one or two goes, uh -huh. you need that. Because, like, yeah. these top characters, like Kazuya, he needs one. Yeah. You know, like, if, if, they're, if they're really good and they don't mess up their combo, they need one in your deck. Uh, like, well, it's really funny, like, you say that, like, you know, the characters, like, for instance, if you talk about Pikachu, Pikachu does a combo, he's going to take you to 60%. But then when you're sitting there, when you're at, like, 80, 90%, like, Pikachu, is there something you can do right now to kill me? If the answer is no, you're, you're just not a top tier character. And that's, yeah. All right, for the longest I've told people, I just Pikachu. Pikachu's overrated. Pikachu does not have that X factor of I'm just going to kill you not every percent that you feel like this is not fair. Mm -hmm. Pikachu is just going to abuse you. Yeah, <laughs> he'll hit you to one forty, yeah, but he's yeah, not going to like. He's just going to abuse you. But until that dash attack kills at eighty <laughs> or yeah, ninety, or, yeah. Woo! All right. So we have Orpaz taking the stock here a lot earlier than we saw in that first game. That first game, uh, you know, got the kill, was sitting at the 70s, got hit right after, was sitting at, you know, a hot and high 92%. But right now, we have a slight lead. And when you get those leads, go for those, go for those reads in the forward smash. Even though you're not hitting it there, uh, you can afford to take a hit. Oh, gosh, dang. Up to up there. But now, now Orpos has to be careful of that grab again because they're kind of they're in that down throw yeah. up air range again. That's something we've seen. Today. Uh -oh. oh, here we go. Once G again. Walker's bad, man. Hey, he's sitting there. I was like, man, is he not DI this move? What's going <laughs> on? All right. That, that's also one, one kind of, I guess, more of a quirky thing about me, Sword Fighter, is like, who has played this character? I was talking, you know, you have like Dr. P, Aaron, and I do remember the other name you mentioned was, but that's like three that are notable. Yeah. So it's like you don't get a lot of experience against this character. You really do not. Oh gosh. Alright. Shock him. That was yeah, crazy. I, like I said, there was like, dang, do all the meat the sword fighters live in the Middle West? Maybe. <laughs> I thought <laughs> it was Lionel the Mega Man, not me, uh, sword fighter. 
Oh, oh yeah, definitely, <laughs> definitely the Heartland area is definitely a Mega Man land. Like, oh yeah. What? Comes in. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, they died it. Yeah, he was going for the forward air on that one. Yeah. I think maybe he might. Well, I mean, maybe even on the stage, he actually could have died because Small Battlefield does have a small ceiling on top. Oh, yeah. That, that, that's true. But that's it. Yep. Yeah. Chakra there. Chakra's that's crazy. crazy. What it is, uh, I, I think, don't know what they. Put I think on. it's a happy birthday with a heart. We're just gonna say it's. A